Hey up, y'all. Fruity here. So, we talk about people with some serious, serious mental issues on this channel all the time. Daniel Larson, Cyrax, Chris Chan, sometimes EDP. But today we're going to be talking about probably the most disturbing individual that we've ever talked to on this channel, right? This, this person is is uh, a danger to themselves and others in a ways that you might not be able to comprehend right now. And this is, and right here, this is a point of no return, all right? And I really mean that. When you start, when you go past this point, you're going to see something that will make you lose your lunch, right? That, that thing I put in the thumbnail, that, that was just a drawing of the Left 4 Dead Witch. I'm just going to be straight up, straight up now, right? That wasn't the person we were even talking about today, because... This is disturbing enough to the point where I didn't even want to put this person in the thumbnail. But it's still something that needs to be talked about. So this individual's name is Eugenia Cooney, and the video I'm playing on screen right now really shows uh, how bad she's gotten. And oh, holy shit. Oh. <laughs> Now that video was, uh, what's even more disturbing is that was a TikTok re-upload to her YouTube channel. And I want you to just imagine being on TikTok randomly, scrolling through your memes and whatnot, and then seeing that. That, that would, uh, that would ruin a lot of people's day. But the thing is, she's just not that. Not that, alright? She also promotes this lifestyle to other people and is flat out in flat out denial of it. Or she knows, which is even worse, because she recently uploaded a video called Why I Left and and, <laughs> and uh she did and a lot of people were thinking, oh thank god she's leaving the internet. She can actually get some help. No, she went to Disneyland. So um if you guys didn't know, I'm actually went away right now. And right now I'm in Disney. So yeah, you guys, I love Disney. Um, it's been a little while since I've been here, and it's been like forever since I've gone to the parks. But yeah, today I'm like back in the parks. Um, a lot of people around, so I'm like, hopefully I'm not being too like being too weird with people. <laughs> Is that a little bit of self reflection I see right there? Of that she knows that her looks are rather shocking. And that she should probably be in the hospital instead of at Disneyland. Because, like, in this later on in this video, you can see that someone actually does look at her. And the look on his face is the, probably the same look that I had earlier when I uh, did that. And I have to be really careful with what I say about her. Because the thing is, she has an eating disorder. And YouTube has a really thin line with eating disorders. I really can't make fun of this person, but at the same time, you all are thinking a lot of the a lot of the jokes in the, your head that I'm probably thinking of, and I'm not going to make them. But yeah, today um, I'm still here for a few more days, um, and today I'm in Animal Kingdom Park. Um, yeah, I love Animal Kingdom. I love all the animals and everything like that. And you guys, in this section right here, I actually didn't even know that Disney had like otters, but apparently they do. I'll have to show you guys them. They look like really cute from what I've seen. One guys, aw. Okay, so it seems like the otters actually kind of like their privacy, because like <laughs> we've been kind of like standing here, but they're just not showing up. But on a side, on a side note, um. <laughs> this is where I'm not gonna I'm gonna stop playing this fucking Disneyland video because she goes into a lot of bullshit about how she's enjoying her time at Disneyland and she's enjoying her life with this eating disorder that literally that is literally making her into basically a walking corpse. Another thing that people are really mad about is that she has recently been collaborating with Jeffrey Star. Now. The situation with Jeffree Star on its own is something that I am in no way prepared to cover in less than a minute on this channel. And in fact, I'm not gonna cover it 
in less than a minute on this channel. All you need to know is that he's got some bad juju behind behind her with him, and that they're also friends. Cool here? Okay. Yeah. So this is one of Wyoming's biggest gun stores. It's amazing. I'm just picking up something that I custom ordered, but look at all the options. Look at all these awesome guns, guys. I gotta, like, get myself some guns. Yeah. <laughs> You're ready to start we'll shooting. Look at the purple one. Ooh, look at this purple one. Oh, the purple one is so That would match your makeup cute. today. It would. Yes. Uh, we're gonna find the perfect one. Let's do it. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'd love to imagine what, what her with a holding a gun or trying to fire it. You know, that that would be a major disaster right there for everyone involved. And anyone who would sell this person a gun, you know, they they can't have been in the right mindset either. I'm pretty sure this goes against some kind of state law. But uh, I really don't want to cover any more of this. It, it's really sickening and disturbing, but I have one more thing to say, and that's due to popular demand... I now have a Discord. You might have seen it, me linking it at Community Pose. It's linked in the description below. And also, big ups to the channel lovely Eugenia Cooney for documenting more of this stuff than I have and bringing it to the limelight. You know, you're big ups to you. And you know what? That's it for today.